Two Fairfax County police officers, a canine, kneel behind trees near a Springfield, Virginia townhouse. Now take a look at this. Another officer stands with his gun pointed directly at the suspect. The suspect is shown with the screen door open, dressed in shorts, a white shirt. Police say the man barricaded himself in the home and they negotiated with him for 40 minutes. At some point, Fairfax County police fired at least one shot, killing the man this evening. Neighbors tell me they only heard one shot. Seem like a good guy. Tonight, Erica Epps tells me she's been the man's neighbor for nine years. She's even hung out with his family in their townhouse. I feel really bad for the wife and children. You know, we know the kids. My daughter played with them. You know, really good kids. It just breaks my heart. Tonight, police tell me this all started around 2.40 this evening. Police received a 911 call from a woman telling them the man has weapons. Police drove to the 7900 block of Pebble Brook Court. They negotiated with the man. He refused to come outside and he would not allow officers inside. At some point, something happened in those negotiations and an officer fired the shot. Next thing I know, there's a police officer at my car door saying you need to get out of the area right now. Police surrounded the home, knocked down the front door with a police tanker. The SWAT team found the body inside. We don't know why police fired or what they found inside the home. We are involved, investigating this as an officer involved shooting. I've also learned that the suspect's common law wife is a DEA employee. Agents actually came out here earlier today and she is talking with police. That is the very latest. I'm Hey, your buddy Justin Wu Lee coming in. So based on that news report, here's my conclusion. You might find this rather interesting and disturbing. Lawful gun owner is inside his house with a female occupant. Female occupant spots firearms, freaks out because she watches too much Piers Morgan and thinks guns are instruments of terrorists. Deport British citizen Piers Morgan for attacking Second Amendment. Calls the cops. The cops show up in military force because we live in a police state. The guy is confronted by modern day SS officers. The guy is freaked out because he's wondering why he has a small army outside of his lawn. They state that some females spotted weapons inside the house and they're here to search the place and turn it upside down. He states, with much distress, exercising my second amendment rights is not grounds for this small SS army to come to my house, tear it upside down, so no, you're not coming in the house, and no, I'm not gonna cooperate with you. Get the hell out of here. Of course, the SS officers don't leave, and he has some hot shot with a badge, thinks he's reaching for a weapon, or gets a little nervous because his hands aren't visible. Take the shot and kill the guy. Welcome to the police state, people, where the zombies watch Piers Morgan and the cops come kill you for exercising your Second Amendment rights.